that is very, very important if, as I said before, to start up, if, if, you, are, if you want your students to be better play badminton on long, on long terms, because they need to have the, the, the right grip, that is very, very important. Um, to get started always, of course, now we have done a lot of different kind of uh, strokes here, close to the left, but there's also the serve. But actually, you don't start practicing the serve. You start practicing this because then the serve situation would be so much easier for them afterwards. When they have the right grip, when they have the right uh, backhand grip or forehand grip, it would be so much easier for them to serve. That's the same with the grip. So, would you please come over here? This side. Because again, if you look at the grip, if you just take the racket from down here and you start serving like this, it makes some kind of sense, but again, it doesn't. And depending on how the way you want to be with your, your foot position here before the serve. But the normal way to make a forehand serve is then it's to be like this. And then, but then it makes it actually difficult to hit it. Uh, so it doesn't make sense to have the racket again like this. And then, and then they start a form. I don't know if you have the rules about that, but it's not serve. But it's not allowed to serve like this. So the height of the racket hit was what not allowed to come higher than around here. And it, at the racket head, it has to go like, like this. You're not allowed to put your racket head like this, so you can put it down. So the racket head has to be showing, pointing down to the floor, uh, so you're not allowed to put it like this. But again, if they have the right grip, and they start making short service, it should be possible just to, with the forehand serve, and the forehand grip, just to easy. Because they have that feeling from before. And the same with the backhand. If you want to make a, a short serve, it's actually easier to make just the backhand grip here, thumb up again, put the rack, uh, shot here in front, and then just hit it with the thumb. So go like this. And then we started playing. I think that's been a big key, especially a lot of students who don't want to play that because we kind of probably go straight to the set before we do all the other stuff there is. And then they, because they don't know, they yeah. go yeah. to the Yeah, and that's the problem with the grip. So you need to just go and if they cannot serve it in the beginning, just let them throw the shot and then they start hitting. But the grip is very important. So when they have the grip, it's going to make be more easy for them. If, and again, if we just start on a very small court, they don't have to make that big swing that is very, very difficult to hit the shuttle and when to drop the shuttle and, and all that stuff. Because it, it of course looks very easy when I'm doing it, but you need of course to have that feeling of when to leave or get the shuttle, when to drop it and when to hit it. But they will have those skills if you just start by playing all this uh, here and the grip and all that. But if they want to serve, instead of just throwing, then just show them the back and Because the back and everybody can make a back and serve, because that's easy. Kind of the way you just put your thumb, put your shuttle in front of the racket, and just that movement. So then you just get started. If you put a, a, a competition or a match situation on here, or they just want to play. So make a back and serve, that's, that's going to be okay. And then it's going to be much, more easier for them, uh, as I said, just to go for the long serve, in the, in the forehand serve, so that's like this. And as you can see, as well, my racket is just going from here. And again, I have my forehand grip, put it out here. Someone has it here, someone there, it doesn't matter. <laughs> but if you have the right grip, you should be able to have a shuttle like this on your racket 
but you hit the shuttle up here with the one pointing down. So I'm just going like this. Just go here. If you have the wrong grip, like you did before, then you get your spare up here before. Then you're gonna hold your erection like this. See? And when you go here, you don't have space and you're gonna hit the shuttle like one out of ten, something like that. So again, basically, it's the grip that is the important thing. And as I said, many, 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 many times, it makes sense if you allow them to play like this. Because then, because they don't go here. Of course they don't. They just want to hit the shuttle on the other side, because if they start rotating, with, with this grip, what happens then? Out with the shot. So of course no one, if they just get a shot and a racket, go in and hold the racket like they have to or should do, because they're not thinking about the rotation. Then it's just going to go like this, because that's the easiest way to get the shot on the other side. So basic grip, 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 grip. That's the important thing. Okay? Yes. Um, yeah? Anything else? Any questions to this? So, if you have some problems already, let me know when you have something in, in badminton. Of course, we've got to move the red button. But the uh, side side, anything? Yeah, let's put it right. Uh, back in serve doesn't matter. You can do whatever you like. Uh, someone, if you serve the back end, someone likes to have the space here. Someone just like this, and someone goes like this. It actually doesn't matter. Uh, that's totally up to you and, and, and yeah, what you prefer. Uh, but of course, when you, you cannot serve the long serve, forehand serve with your right foot in front, so you need to have the, the left foot like this and your right foot like pointing this way, yeah, in this direction. So it, it cannot be like this or this, because that will not make you comfortable. So you need to put your left foot in front and then just relax and then go. But back and serve, you can do whatever the kids are.